Hi everyone! So today I thought I would do something a little bit different. You've left the house. I've left the house and I have come to Leslie's house instead. Now I'm going to admit to you that this video is inspired by someone else. <laughs> Just before Christmas, Phil Lester, who as we all know is my YouTube senpai, did a Bob Ross tutorial video. That's a good idea, yeah. I'm gonna steal it. That's what she thought. Yeah, I've decided it's time for us to do a Bob Ross tutorial because this can only go well. As you may be aware, Leslie is very talented. I'm really not. <laughs> so. I'm excited. This, this is a potentially career-ending video for me. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna throw that one out there. This is what Leslie does. So I'm actually a Bob Ross impersonator. I mean, it's it's, it's outstanding. Uncanny. It's like he's uncanny, in the room. Yeah. Let's pick a video. I, so we've now got a list of Bob Ross videos. Leslie's gonna make me choose on name alone. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Cliffside. Wilderness Cabin, Valley View. I don't know why I'm doing it like the football results. I know. <laughs> Charlton Athletic 1. <laughs> 4, 5, 4, 5, 5. <laughs> Dimensions. Ooh. Deep Wilderness Home. Change of Seasons. Pastel Seascape. Mm -hmm. Wintertime Blues. Ooh. Serenity. Oh, I like that. Silent Forest. Royal Majesty. <laughs> Oh, we These need to are all major racehorses. That aren't could they? be a winner. I'm pretty sure Royal yeah. Majesty has won the. the I, nearly said, I nearly said the Grand Prix. <laughs> <laughs> That's a quick horse. That's one fast horse. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? A horse is due. The Apart from Grand the name. National. Grand National. I knew it had Grand in it. I'm really torn, sorry, <laughs> I'm really torn between Serenity and Dimension. I liked the sound of Dimensions. Let's do Dimensions. I'm going to make a suggestion. Because we are using entirely the wrong paint, yeah. and not a canvas, Bob Ross uses a wet in wet oil paint technique. Okay. So he's putting wet paint onto wet paint. So what I'm going to suggest is because we're using acrylic paint is that we do a coat of white acrylic paint yeah. mixed with slow drying medium so that it stays wet. She's very good isn't she? I haven't... you said a lot of words then. Whoosh. Yes, let's do that. Okay. Are we ready for, for Bob time? Totally ready for Bob time. Come on, oh, Bob. wow! It's, that, that's not that's the intro, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I thought we needed a broom and we were going to paint on the wall. No. No. <laughs> The white squares. I hope not. I'm I not feel like we've bitten off more than we can chew yeah, already. I'm not good at a straight line. Uh, hey, welcome back. Right. Certainly we are. He's taped it off. And I've picked up some masking tape here laying around the studio. <laughs> Let's start out today with a small amount of yellow ochre. Very, very small amount on the two inch brush. I just paint right over the masking tape, just like it wasn't even there. Yellow ochre! Yay! Oh, you were so excited for that. Okay, and we're just gonna just bung it, Do the bung it in the corner because Bob said to. And all these fantastic hues happen automatically. All my hues are happening. The hue Grant? All the hues. Hue Laurie. Hugh oh. Edwards. Hughes. I've run out of Hughes. Go right into a small amount of the Midnight Black. Midnight Black? Don't need much, just a little. This just feels a little. potentially just paint, like painting, painting ruining. Now just over here, black. we just take that black and it will just begin on the other side of the sky. Bob, what are you doing? Now, it's a bit apocalyptic, honestly. It really is, and, and yours so much better <laughs> but it's fine okay just blend these together so you can't tell where one color stops and the next color starts shut up oh i've got to show you something here 
I have to show you that a, a gentleman made this for me. This is a cane that he carved, and it is unreal. But he's actually put. I'm so of afraid of the cane. Mm -hmm. Legs. <laughs> Here's another peak right here. Just wherever you think a little peak should live. I'm afraid. Or well, have we peaked too soon? Uh, I am brave. You don't have to let Bob Ross dictate your entire life. No, I do. <laughs> We were meant to paint with knives. Oh. oh! Oh no. I'm running out of my colour now and I'm playing a dangerous game. Oh, I've added too much paint. I've added too much paint. It's not a drill. And I need to just smooth this bit. They are very smooth mounted. <laughs> Just grab that and pull it, just like we normally do to make a mountain. Bob, I think you find out. I, I smooth like my mountains right down. I imagine if I know my Bob Ross, we're going to be going in with some white highlights. What's the difference between a hill and a mountain? Is it just a height thing? Um, let us know in the comments. Yeah, let's just take some titanium white. We'll pull that out very flat. Cut across. Uh -oh. Get a roll of paint again. Always have that little roll of paint. Now we can go up in here and just start laying. What did I say? Right on this mountain. Barely, barely touching. Barely touching. Let's graze the canvas. I'm going to graze my canvas. So. <coughs> I barely touched too well. Barely touching. No, I can't. <laughs> No, that's, that's just a really snowy bit. It's okay. <laughs> I feel like you're going to wake up in a cold sweat scene. <laughs> All together now. Barely touching. Let's take a little white, a little bit of thalo blue, mix together. We'll use that for a shadow color. My shadows look terrible. I mean, I'm not happy anymore. I was really pleased with my mountain. I was pleased with my mountains, Bob Ross. And now I'm deeply unhappy. shade of blue that mine has become. <laughs> Did that help? Not really. We all make mistakes and as long as we keep trying. There's no mistakes. Remember this is Bob Ross. You've made a happy accident. Yeah. I'm not doing any more to the mountains. I dislike what he's made me do to them. I'm I'm sad about them and I'm leaving them. Now. You're having a lot of feelings over there, aren't you? Yeah. They don't look like ridges anymore. They're just like weirdly blue mountains. <laughs> <laughs> this is how serious I am that I'm not adding any more. Oh, I've just painted my hair. I'm gonna wash this. Yeah. In your face, Bob Ross. Don't wash it in its face. <laughs> I've returned to being semi-pleased with the mountains. Yeah, we take a clean and very dry. Two inch brush. That's what all that beating was. I was just making sure it was dry. And then very gently lift upward. That'll help create that illusion of mist down at the base of the mountain. Okay. Now then, we're ready to start putting some little footy hills in. So then we put in some foothills. Whoops! <laughs> well, I 
a scissor hill there now. <laughs> I feel like your foot hills are getting increasingly angry. <laughs> I just wanted to look nice! Now, let's have a little water down here while we have this color on here. We can just come right in here. Put in the indication of a little bit of water floating around. the genius of Bob Ross. Oh, I just stuck my finger in the paint. Oh, uh, and done. We'll pull a little of that straight down. Straight down. That'll end up being our reflections under that little foothill back here. I don't have the light touch that I think is necessary for something like this. A nice. little bit of the liquid white, pull it out as flat as you can get it, and then take a knife and just cut across. That's all there is to it. Then go up here and act just like you're trying to cut a hole right through the canvas. I get very afraid when I have to use this and do a line. Oh no, I think what we've learned here is if I don't have a steady hand. <laughs> Let's have this group of little distant trees, they're bigger closer to us. If I remember, they come right down something like so. Uh -huh. I feel like my trees are not going to look like that. Right. And it's just like down, 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 down. I'm really scared. I don't think I can bring myself to do it. I guarantee if you paint this one, people will look at it. Oh, they're gonna look. My oh, trees out. have become much too hom homogenous. <laughs> <laughs> they're just a clump. They all want a homogenous tree. Yeah. Trees. Yeah. Bam. Blob. Done. The homogenous bush is complete. I'm gonna add to that same color we just had some brown. What, just brown? What kind of brown? You can't just have Be specific, Bob. The concentration is real now. It really is, isn't it? I'm now very much aware that I've just painted a ball. My bit that's supposed to be like the reflection of my landmass is just a smudge. We can go right into a little of the cad yellow, yellow ochre, Indian yellow, and, and then I'll hit a little touch of the bright red. But mix the color on the brush so you have a multitude of colors happening right there in your brush. Okay, let's go back up here. Now, we'll put some nice green highlights right out here on this little peninsula that jets out into the water. Oh boy! <laughs> I'm just gonna tap yeah, some things on my brush. Keep dabbing. Oh, Bob. Bob, why, Bob? This is so upset with you, Why have you betrayed me? This is not what I was meant to do. Like. I mean, if you really hate it, you can always, like, chop the bottom of the painting off. <laughs> Here's my painting of mountains. No! I will see this through to the end!
And I think with that, we're going to call this one finished. Leslie, would you like to show off your Bob Ross painting? Look at that! That's amazing! It's not bad. I'm That's... still not pleased with the mountains, but maybe from a distance they'll be... I, I think they're fabulous. Okay. The mountains are the only bit of mine I'm actually happy with! Look at this monstrosity! What the hell is it? Answers in the comment. No. <laughs> um, do you know what? For somebody who can't paint, <coughs> I don't think it's awful. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video and you feel bad for me with my <laughs> terrible art, please give me a thumbs up. If you would like to subscribe, somewhere a floaty head will appear, and also last week's video will appear somewhere if I can fit it in. And go now and do some some beautiful paintings and I'll see you next week. Bye!